hey guys and welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a super quick but delicious recipe for a sweet potato pie so if you want to please your family and friends this holiday season make sure you stay tuned and get cooking let's go ahead and get started so I start by preparing all of my ingredients and laying them out so here's everything that you're gonna need minus the vanilla not really sure why I have that out but here's everything and then you're gonna go and boil your sweet potatoes for about 45 minutes until they're nice and tender and once they are done you just go ahead and drain all of the water out and what I kind of like to do is I just add a little bit of cold water over the potatoes and let them sit for about 15 to 20 minutes just so they're nice and cool because fresh out they will be super super hot so you want to make sure that you wait a little bit before you go and peel them okay so once they've cooled off a little bit they're going to be super super easy to peel like the skin is going to literally almost fall off of the potato so as you can see i'm just peeling all of the dead or all of the skin off and any of the like the brown marks or just the ugly little marks that you don't like you can go ahead and peel those away as well or cut them off whatever you want to do and once they're all peeled, you're going to want to go ahead and take them over to a fruit processor or a blender. I don't have a fruit processor. I can't say that word. I don't have a food processor. So I just go ahead and blend them up in my big blender. And to make it a little bit easier, I just go ahead and chop them up into little chunks. And then we're just going to blend, blend, blend. Now it's going to be super easy to blend because they're going to be nice and soft. But there might be a couple of bigger chunks. But don't worry. Try to get rid of as many chunks as you can. But if you don't get rid of all of them, don't worry because you will be blending again. So once you have it all blended and kind of in a puree form, you're going to want to go in and add your sugar, your brown sugar, your eggs, your half and half, some nutmeg, don't go overboard on the nutmeg, please, <laughs> and some cinnamon. And last but not least, a little bit of melted butter. And then you're just gonna go ahead and mix it up till it's nice and smooth with no bumps, no lumps, and yeah, it should be this kind of consistency. Not too watery, but you know, a nice consistency. So we just go ahead and take the pie crust and plop the filling into the pie crust. Now if you're fancy, you can go ahead and make your pie crust from scratch, but I got a little bit lazy so I went and bought some at the store. So it's totally up to you, your preference. And this is what it'll look like before it goes in the oven. And then you just want to go ahead and preheat your oven to about 350 degrees and an hour later and this is what it looks like. And so my battery totally died and I forgot to show you guys the finished product, but I did take pictures. So here are some pictures from it. And yeah, guys, your family will totally thank you. You will be their best friend. You will be that cousin, that sister, whatever. And yeah, you guys will enjoy it. And that pie will be gone before you leave. Trust me. People will be going back for seconds. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Let me know that you liked it and comment below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.